Hi everyone, Brandon DeGaff here from Two Clicks From KO. It's that time of year. Another big release from West Kids means another Gravity Feed Primer set for us to get our appetites whetted for the upcoming Wolverine and the X-Men set. Uh, inside this 24 count Gravity Feed case, I've got eight unopened packs that we are going to open right now. Um, this set's going to have Wolverine, Lady Deathstrike, Toad, Cyber, Shi'ar Guard, Jean Grey, Colossus, Shadowcat, Havoc, and Multiple Man, or Madrox, or Jay Madrox, whatever you want to call them. So let's go ahead and get it going. First pack. And we have Colossus. All right, he's one of the ones I really wanted. Really hoping to get Colossus here. And Wolverine and Cyber. Lady Deathstrike as well. And Havoc. A, <laughs> I think I want all of them. That, there he is. There's Havoc. So I got two of my big ones so far. Next pack. Multiple, man. Awesome. I would, that's one guy right there I wouldn't mind having multiples of. But, um, that was me emulating a rim shot. I know, not that good. Let's see what else we got. Another Havoc. I guess that's okay. There's something to trade away. Pack number five. Please be Wolverine. A Lady Deathstrike. Another one I was really hoping to get. Sweet. Happy with these thus far. Another Lady Death Strike. Okay. Come on, two more left. Come on, I hope Wolverine's one of them. Or Cyber. Another Lady Death Strike. Oh boy. This is gonna be my Wolverine. Come on, Wolverine. It's Cyber. Wolverine! Alrighty. Sweet. Looking at the uh, paint applications here, the Colossus looks pretty dang good. Um, I don't see any, really much of anything wrong with them. And the, like a little unpainted spot in the knee, a little bit of a overlap red there on his uh, right leg. I um, mean, if not. Not noticeable or uh, doesn't ruin the figure at all. Then uh, Wolverine, not in the same category as uh, Colossus. Um, a little blurry blue paint on the top. Could use a little bit better paint on the legs. There's a few spots there, and apparently he's got a little blue on his arm. But I mean, it, it still looks pretty solid. Uh, the Havoc sculpt looks amazing. If uh, you know anything about me and my taste in figures, I love me some clear plastic and those um, awesome little effects on his arms look um, look really great. I was kind of um, thinking before I saw this sculpt that he might look something like Thunder did from the Teen Titans set. Just uh, maybe a little bit of variation in the sculpt, but no, it looks, I like it a lot. Big fan of this. So. This guy is going to look pretty, uh, this, this is a really cool sculpt too. Um, you can see the M. I mean, you can't see it in the camera. But he has an M over his right eye, and uh, his face uh, only slightly derpy. I guess it's not full derp like Sin, but uh, trench coat looks nice on him. Paint looks nice. Um, pretty solid looking. The Lady Death Strike, and I checked on all three of mine. They don't have belly buttons. Their midriff is showing, um, but yeah, no belly buttons. That's the biggest gripe I have about the figure. The metal on the hands looks really nice, and the way the, the her dress is swaying like, as, like she's in mid-step looks pretty cool. So yeah, the sculpts look really, really nice here. So here we have the uh, eight figures pulled from the single packs. Uh, Colossus and Wolverine here are both switch clicks, and you got Havoc, Multiple Man, and uh, Lady Deathstrike. And here's my stack of cards. I mean, it's per usual with the gravity feeds and the countertop displays. They don't always come in uh, flat. So I'll, I'll work on flattening those out shortly. 
but yeah, I'm pretty happy with the eight here, especially the um, the Colossus and the Wolverine and the ha Havoc <laughs> and the Lady Deathstrike. You know, I'm happy with all the multiple man. Uh, I'm going to hope I can trade for a handful of those guys just so I can um, have fun using his ability. just want to thank everybody for watching this video. Uh, please like it, please comment on it, please share it, and please subscribe to Two Clicks from KO. Don't forget to check out our Two Clicks from KO podcast. You can find us by searching for Two Clicks from KO in the iTunes podcast library. Thanks for watching, everybody.